Alright, so let's, let's look at this question here, which is on um, transformation of graph. Let's say I can do this proficiently. So the diagram below shows a sketch of a curve equation y equals to gx. The curve has an asymptotes with equation of x equals to 0 and y equals to 2. The curve for x equals to 2a is 2a <laughs> and so on, 0 and so on. So we are told to sketch a curve with this equation. Uh, this equation is pretty okay. So what we need to know is because this is gx, right? What we need now is actually change to this. So in other words, what we need is a reflection about the replace x with uh, minus x so this will be g negative x who means reflect about y axis after which we just mod it right so we just module it so in other words th this is pretty okay i think it's not really a big issue there because what we need is just um, reflect this one over then just flip it up okay so for this graph here what i will say is essentially just for the first part okay just reflect about the y axis first so it looks something like that. I'm just going to draw, draw this out. Yeah. Okay, I hope this is like... Uh, probably the axes are, are not... Uh, they are perpendicular and they are like... Okay, vertical and horizontally not slanted. This is... Let me just draw it out. Let's compare. Okay, so this part here what you get is y and this is x so if you reflect about the y uh the the y-axis you will still get the same horizontal asymptote here so this is something like that go up all right then after which you just come down like that all right so this is y equals to two reflect and this a would just be a prime negative two zero all right then this c here will be c prime we can just put this c prime uh negative seven zero okay so that's pretty okay so the the vertical uh, so we just reflect about the y-axis first then what we need next is actually just um reflect this point here up because now we we are going to reflect it right so this case here reflect it up v v is negative seven then reflect this point up would then be uh just take notice it's four negative two so it will touch the okay it will touch the um here so this is b prime is negative 4 2 negative 4 2 it will touch the horizontal asymptote so this is b prime this is 4 2 so just check your answer i think for the first part is pretty okay so it's y equals to modulus g negative x mod it all right that's about it and then the subsequent comes the subsequent part. All right, the subsequent part we need to reciprocate this. So let's see how we can do this reciprocate uh, reciprocal um, graph here. Now the first thing is to take note that is that uh, the horizontal asymptote will become the x-intercept. So I mean the vertical asymptote will become x-intercept. So this will be x-intercept here. Then you have a vertical asymptote this side, right? So I'm just gonna draw it out. The markers down first. Just draw this out and this will be something like that. Y and X and becomes the X intercept here, which is zero comma zero. Cause the vertical asymptote will become um, the X intercept. Okay. So if you, then we have X equals to four, vertical here and vertical here. Okay. So this would be another vertical asymptote down. We are drawing the reciprocal graph. So I'm going to draw the down it. Another one. Okay, draw the markers first. So x equals to 4 and x equals to 6. So this is x equals to 4. 
and this is x equals to 7. Okay, what else we need? Okay, the horizontal asymptote will remain the same, so I'm just going to draw horizontal asymptote of y equals to half, but I'm going to make it the same height as so that I can exaggerate some of the properties there. So this is y equals to half. Okay, go. So y equals to half here. Then uh, we know that this will be a max point of uh, b prime will be just uh, this will be a maximum point. So this is 4. negative half okay or rather the same height as this so it's like four negative half like that this is the maximum point then this part here uh approaching from bottom uh any any other thing just no okay so now we can start sketching so this case here when these are meeting at the both end here it will be a minimum point on the axis okay when they are meeting both sides because this will be brought down this will be brought down as well so it'll be a minimum point here, and this will approach from bottom here. So in other words, your uh, when you approach from top, so reciprocal, it will be here. They will come down here, mean point, and after which this part here will go to infinity. We go to infinity here. So this case here will be like that, go up to infinity. Okay. Uh this over here will go to negative infinity. This will go to negative infinity. So this will be like here and here. Okay. Then this case here, this one go to positive infinity. This one approach from bottom, approach from top. So this case here will be here to here. I think it's pretty okay. Once everything is done, we can start sketching. Uh, how do we sketch that is... Let me just do this. Okay, and start sketching really. So this case here... We will just go from here, mean point. Go. Okay. Then this will just be here. Maximum point come down. And here will just be here to here. Alright. So this is how you uh do this part here. Yeah, I need to erase away this. Okay, so this is how you do this part here proficiently. If you have any question or comments at all, please let us know. Uh, keep practicing. Yeah, I'll see you in the next question. Okay, I think this is pretty okay. Anything else I need to? I missed out. B prime. Mm, what else? It's about it.